Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe and put likes, because your support is important for us. And here we go. On February 25, 2024, the Max Defense Philippines Facebook page shared images of training sessions for drivers and operators of the new VBTP MSR Guarani 6x6 Armored Personnel Carriers, APCs, signaling a crucial step towards their incorporation into the Philippine Army. These vehicles, currently undergoing rigorous field trials, are yet to be equipped with weapon systems, indicating that the delivery of the initial batch of five units is nearing completion. Jointly developed with Iveco Defense Vehicles and the Brazilian Ministry of Defense, the Guarani is engineered to provide both ballistic protection and amphibious capabilities, designed to transport a team of 10 infantrymen alongside a driver. The procurement is part of a $46 million contract with Israeli firm Elbit Systems, signed on February 7, 2021 encompassing the supply of 28 Guarani 6x6 vehicles, with delivery scheduled between 2023 and 2024. This agreement forms part of a broader government-to-government -government military pact overseen by the International Defense Cooperation Directorate of the Israeli Ministry of Defense, SIBAT, potentially encompassing a total of 114 Guarani vehicles for the Philippine Army. Customized features for the Philippine variant include Level 3 ballistic protection plates according to the Stanag 4569 standard, a battle management system, and a software-defined radio provided by Elbit Systems, alongside a remotely controlled weapon system, RCWS, armed with either a 12.7x99mm, 0.50BMG, or a 7.62x51mm machine gun. The APC boasts armor protection against small arms fire, artillery shell fragments, and landmines, thanks to its V-shaped hull, with the option for additional composite armor for heightened defense. Internally, the vehicle is furnished with a small liner. Powered by a PFT diesel engine generating 383 horsepower, made it to a ZF fully automatic transmission. It achieves a top road speed of 100 km per hour and a range of approximately 600 km. It is air transportable via a C-130 Hercules and fully amphibious, featuring two water jets at the rear. With five units already manufactured and awaiting shipment following customs procedures, and the remaining 23 units in various stages of production. The integration of these APCs into the armed forces signifies a significant milestone in enhancing the defensive capabilities of the Philippine Army. That's all for now. See you later.